Hey guys, we are back in my bedroom again. Uh, see the 1024 is over there. And basically is what we have a, like a train speedway. So we have, today we're going to be comparing two trains. I know coronavirus makes me bored, so this is the only thing I can post. Uh, but before we start, I hope you guys are staying safe, stay inside, wash your hands, do everything you can to, um protect yourself because all those nurses around they're doing their best to keep everyone alive so uh the least you could do is just stay inside wash your hands and take this thing seriously anyway um now we are going to do the demonstration of each train we're going to start with the well first uh so here we have on the the big train we have a santa express aztec christmas themed train uh, this train is from the year 2010, and then in the middle we have a, uh, it's not really themed, but it says Sesame Street on it, uh, I've never known it to be a Sesame Street train, but it's just a little train, and this one is actually, um, from 1996, so it's a lot older, uh, and then the remotes, we have, here's the remotes, uh, the black remote is for this train and the yellow remote is for this train uh, i'm going to start off with this train um you know what i'm going to unplug this chart okay all right we're going to start off with this train just hit the little button on the top and the light turns on and then on the remote you see there's a little switch on the bottom well okay so it's already going. Uh, so I'm just going to, you push this button and hold it down and the train will go. It's pretty fast, I guess. Remote makes noise, train noises. I don't know if you can hear it because the train is loud. So yeah, there's supposed to be like a barrel thing on each side, but like it quit working, and then you can back it up. Uh. And then it quits backing up there. All right, and then uh, just turn it off with the button on the back. All right. So, pro about this thing is the remote makes cool noises. Con is that uh, the train doesn't make any cool noises, be or any noise at all, because the only so the only noise you hear out of the train is just squeaking. Uh, well, that train doesn't squeak, but they would both squeak if I didn't lube that one up. I just haven't lubed this one up yet. Probably will do that soon. Uh, Con only has three cars, whereas the other one has five. Pro the three cars uh, does mean that um, it takes up a lot less space, like. It just, if you didn't have the other train, you just have this tiny little track in the middle of your room, whatever the other one. Th and this is using all the pieces on both of the track setups. Yeah, and then uh, this one, it takes up the whole rug. Anyway, um, con is that uh, this button doesn't turn it off, so you just have to wait till it turns off, and it's, it takes a while, so it kind of drains the battery down quicker. Yeah. Anyway, now we're going to review this train. Uh, so turn it on, you push the little, turn the little knob on the top. Uh, same thing as that one, headlight turns on on the top. And uh, here's the remote for it. Uh, you can, it goes forward, backward stop, and you can actually put, it makes Christmas, plays Christmas songs. about that one is a lot faster this one's kind of slow uh on the other hand this one is very musical uh whereas that one's not and uh yeah anyway i'm gonna go ahead and turn it off so um yeah just turn it off that one turns off so, uh, 
yeah, we'll go ahead and talk about what the both of these trains contain. Um, so this one, it has three um, cars, and the engine takes four, I'm pretty sure, AA batteries in it, whereas the remote takes... I think maybe a 9 volt. Either a 9 volt or two double A's. And then the Christmas train, uh, there is f four C batteries that go into the engine and uh, a 9 volt that goes into the back of the remote. Uh, so yeah, I guess that's about it. It has five cards, by the way. And uh, yeah, uh, nothing really much to say. Anything else really to say? Uh, the light did go out on the tiny train. Uh, but I think now what I'll let you do is I'll let you see both the trains run at the same time. So, fire up. Fire up. Turn this on. On. All right. Grab the other remote. Alright. Sit down here. And uh, let these babies go. And just let it. That's probably good. All right, I'm gonna go ahead and turn this off. And uh, yeah, thanks for watching. Uh, oh, one more thing, I just want to say another con about the Sesame Street train. Uh, well, the only problem is with the remote. That honestly, I mean, I'm okay with it, but uh, you have to hold this to make it go however with this one you just push the button and it goes but anyway uh as far as a competition goes both of them tie they're both really cool and great trains um yeah thanks for watching see ya